Think dinosaurs were the pinnacle of prehistoric terror. The annals of time have more harrowing tales to tell. Imagine predatory shrimps stretching two meters, the supreme ruler of crocodiles, or the era's most massive reptile. Some say this latter behemoth was a hundredfold more intimidating than any dinosaur. Stay with me till the end of this video where I'll unveil this enigmatic creature. But first, we'll delve into a countdown of the most menacing and eerie beings from the ancient world. Join me as we unearth the true titans of times long past. Number 10. Giant Ground Sloth Few people would think of being afraid of modern sloths. On the contrary, many consider them to be one of the cutest and funniest animals, but it would be difficult to call their ancestors funny. Some of them were predators, and some of them even lived underwater. But the most impressive great-grandfather of today's sloths was Megatherium, or the giant ground sloth. Megatherium was one of the largest terrestrial animals, twice the height of an elephant, reaching 6 meters in length and weighing as much as 7 tons. Studies of the fossils have shown that it moved mainly on its hind legs, using its powerful tail as additional support. As an herbivore, the giant ground sloth used its forelegs with huge claws to grab the branches of trees and bend them to the ground. Why would an herbivore need such huge claws? Scientists have no doubt that in case of danger, Megatherium could use them for defense and even attack. By the way, giant ground sloths inhabited the territories of North and South America, and some people believe that a couple of such creatures are still lurking in the rainforest. Do you believe in such hypotheses? Could giant ground sloths really be hiding somewhere in the forests of America? Share your thoughts in the comments and stay tuned because there are a lot of other creepy ancient creatures in this video that were scarier than dinosaurs. The nine meter monster with the strongest armor in the animal world, the king of crocodiles, and the mysterious predator X are further in this video. Let's move on. Number nine, giant predatory shrimp. 500 million years ago, the world was dramatically different than it is today. A striking example is giant predatory shrimps that inhabited the world ocean at that time. In essence, the two-meter-long Animalicurus was a primitive relative of modern crustaceans and other arthropods. However, these creatures looked much more bizarre. Their remains were first discovered in Canada. At the time, scientists could not create a complete portrait of the creature. However, fossils found later in Australia and China led scientists to recreate a complete picture of the appearance of Anomalocaris. According to paleontologists, this creature had no limbs except for two flexible whiskers near the mouth opening, in which it caught and tore trilobites and other small invertebrates. Nevertheless, Anomalocaris swam very well, bending the plates of its shell. Scientists suppose that Anomalocaris led a diurnal lifestyle and lived in places with a favorable climate. In general, it inhabited practically all the Earth. It's not surprising because in those times, the water areas occupying most of the planet had ideal conditions for the life and distribution of these arthropods. Number 8. Forest Rakos Forest Rakos is an ancient species of birds of prey from the family of the same name, which lived in South America for millions of years. These huge and deadly birds were considered among the top predators in their range. The height of adults in this species ranged from one to two and a half meters, but paleontologists came across the remains of real giants, which were three meters tall and weighed 300 kilograms. Thanks to its long legs, forest hercos could run at speeds of up to 50 kilometers per hour. According to scientists, even ungulates could become its prey. The last forest rakos became extinct about 13 million years ago, although scientists suspect that some individuals may have migrated to Africa, where they lived for a long time and died out only 13 to 11,000 years ago. Number 7. Dunkleosters A hundred million years before the first dinosaurs, ocean dwellers could already frighten anyone. A particularly creepy creature was Dunkleosters, one of the largest vertebrates that inhabited the world's oceans about 358 million years ago. Areas above modern-day North America were covered by seas where this prehistoric predator reigned. Looking at this creature, 
It's easy to believe that the oceans of that time were inhabited by both huge eels and creepy creatures the size of buildings. The largest of the described species of Dunkleosteus was estimated to be about 9 meters long and weighed 4 tons. The front part of its body was covered with thick plates. This fish generally boasted the strongest armor in the animal world. Curiously, Dunkleosteus didn't even have teeth. Two bony plates with sharp edges performed their function. These plates were self-sharpening. Their edges sharpened each time the fish opened or closed its jaws. In this way, the sharpest knives were made, which were enough to kill even the largest fish of the time. Number 6. Sarcosuchus Sarcosuchus, also known as the king of crocodiles, was a real prehistoric monster that lived in what is now Africa and South America. These creatures lived in the middle of the Cretaceous period 120 million to 93 million years ago. It was the largest crocodile morph that ever inhabited the Earth. Sarcosuchus maximus's length was 9 meters, plus these monsters weighed up to 3 tons compared to Sarcosuchus. Today's crocodiles look like dwarfs. The reason is that nowadays, these reptiles stop growing when they reach maturity, while their ancestors continue to grow throughout their lives. Of course, fish alone was not enough for such giants. Sarcosuchus also hunted dinosaurs. Number 5. Jackalopterus As you've already seen, in ancient times, our planet was inhabited by the strangest and creepiest creatures, but did you know that prehistoric times could boast giant sea scorpions? Sure, sea scorpions live in the world's ocean today, but Jackalopterus is another matter entirely. Fossilized claws measuring 46 centimeters long mean the size of the scorpion itself was about two and a half meters. The first fossils of the giant sea scorpion were found in Germany. This creature is one of the largest arthropods ever discovered. Jackalopterus lived in freshwater lakes and rivers about 400 million years ago. At that time, the oxygen content in the atmosphere was much higher, which caused the appearance of giant animals. Today, there's evidence that Jekyllopterus is a relative of these arthropods. However, unlike its terrestrial descendants, this creature has remained aquatic, for which it was called the sea scorpion. Number 4. Platybelodon Platybelodon is a truly unique member of the elephant's family. Platybelodon herds inhabited the territories of Africa, Europe, Asia, and North America 4 million years ago. But if famous mastodons and mammoths are quite easy to compare with today's elephants, Platybelodon stood out very clearly. Imagine an ordinary elephant, but without a trunk and with a huge forked bucket instead of a lower jaw. It was believed that Platybelodon preferred to settle in swampy areas or near ponds, which served as its main source of food. Number 3. Helicoprion this ancestor of modern sharks inhabited the oceans about 255 million years ago. Adult individuals could reach 12 meters in length, but it was not the size of these creatures that amazed scientists. It all began with the discovery of a mysterious giant spiral among the fossils clearly created by the bone tissues of a living creature. Russian geologist Alexander Karpinsky realized that this spiral once belonged to a cartilaginous fish and described a new genus and species using the name Helicoprion for the first time. Examining the individual, Karpinski discovered dentin in the composition of the fossil, from which he concluded that the mysterious spiral was located in the mouth and not on the back of the fish, as some American and European paleontologists had assumed. However, the structure of teeth seemed very strange to biologists. Some scientists speculated that the shark used the spiral to dig shellfish out of the sand on the seafloor, while others thought that the spiral allowed it to trim the tentacles, and its jaw teeth allowed it to crush shells. Assuming that Helicoprion fed on fish, it's logical to assume that the spiral caused serious wounds to the prey, and the remaining teeth allowed Helicoprion to eat prey with thick scales. Number 2. Titanobo Many people consider modern anacondas to be the most terrifying snakes in the animal world. Well, in ancient times, much more terrible creatures lived on the territory of South America, the legendary giant Titanobo. 
It outlived dinosaurs by about 5 million years. The disappearance of giant lizards from Earth actually freed the top of the food chain, and huge snakes were able to take advantage of it. An adult individual reached 13 to 14 meters in length and weighed from 1 to 1 and a half tons. Although it was originally thought that Titanobo was the top predator in the food chain, evidence suggests that this animal mainly fed on fish, that is, it was an ichthyophagist, which is unusual for bow constrictors. Number 1. Predator X Fifteen years ago, scientists discovered two skeletons of previously unknown prehistoric creatures on a narrow archipelago between Europe and the North Pole. The first one was dubbed Predator X because its size and body structure did not resemble any of the dinosaurs known to science. Long years of studies and comparisons have only confirmed the initial assumption that the find was a new species and this species could easily claim the title of the most terrible ocean inhabitant of its time. In 2011, the monster, reaching 11 to 13 meters in length, received the scientific name Pleosaurus funky. Predator X was the largest marine reptile of its time. Because of its size and strength, it was victorious in any fight and thus had no natural enemies. Having a long and narrow body with a short tail, it moved quickly in the water and could easily catch up with any prey. The skull of Predator X is considered one of the largest of all predators that existed on the planet. Its length could reach 2.7 meters. Thanks to its enormous and powerful teeth, it was easy for the species to bite its prey in half and crush its bones. It's estimated that its biting power was six times greater than that of T-Rex. That's all. Guys, what other ancient monsters do you know? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and see you later.